U.S. Federal Reserve Vice Chair Leo Brennard said that a central bank digital currency could exist alongside stable coins and provide a measure of safety. Brennard's comments were part of testimony released in advance of her appearance in front of the House Financial Services Committee on Thursday. Quote, CBDC could coexist with and be complementary to stable coins and commercial bank money, providing a safe central bank liability in the digital financial ecosystem, much like cash currently coexists with commercial bank money. She also wrote that thoughtful regulation is necessary given the recent collapse of TerraUSD and Luna. Quote, the rapid ongoing evolution of the digital financial system at the national and international levels should lead us to frame the question not as whether there is a need for a central bank issued digital dollar today, but rather whether there may be conditions in the future that may give rise to such a need. We recognize there are risks of not acting just as there are risk of acting, unquote. Brennard also addressed the capabilities of a CBDC to facilitate global payments and how the U.S. can serve as an example in digital finance with, quote, privacy, accessibility, interoperability, and security, unquote. For its part, the Federal Reserve have been soliciting comments recently on the advisability of setting up a CBDC. Wall Street bankers have expressed concerns that a U.S. CBDC could disrupt the banking system while Circle, the issuer of stablecoin USDC, said a federal stablecoin might squash private sector tokens. Fed officials have routinely said that U.S. Central Bank doesn't intend to move forward on a CBDC without backing from the president and the Congress. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank you for listening in to Fudney's Dad channel. Uh, I ask that you subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell for some more crypto news. Take care, everyone.